boy. Uh, Lollapalooza kicks off today in Grand Park. Hundreds of thousands of music fans will converge downtown for the start of the four-day festival. Tonight's headliners are Hozier and Megan The Stallion. And joining us now with a set with a preview of the weekend's events, journalist Doma T. Pongo. Good to see you. Good morning. See you. Oh, so, good morning. You know, who are you looking forward to seeing? Because, you know, a lot of people have their favorites, but you cover these things. Who do yes. you think are the big acts to see? Megan The Stallion. That's tonight. Hands down. That's yeah. tonight. Megan Stallion's performing. She's got the lyrics. She's got the body, yada, yada, pun intended. Yeah. I mean, SZA, I'm a R&B and hip hop guy. SZA is going to be performing tomorrow. Uh -huh. Very much looking forward to SZA and Victoria Monet. Oh, my mom is like the song of the summer right now, and she's one of those performers that I think is going to be one of those marquee artists of this generation. She wowed people at the BET Awards with her tribute to Usher. She's one of those ones, and the Killers the, it, yeah. are performing yeah. as well. Yeah. yeah. A lot That's of people great. that uh, our reporter was out there at the and at the gate, and a lot of the kids lining up early were talking about Chapel Roan too. Yes, a lot of people yes. don't know who that is. Well, one of the great things about these festivals yeah. is that it's not just about the big headliners. Yeah. It's about learning about all of these new artists. Mm -hmm. I mean, if you look at the flyer and you feel like you don't know these names, that is a good thing because festivals are where you get a chance uh -huh. to learn about all of these different people. One of the acts I'm thinking about is Tyler too. Tyler, uh, she won best. African performance at the Grammys. Mm. Uh, Jess, she has the, the the song Water that challenge is taking over on TikTok, mm. um, and she's performing uh, this weekend as well. Actually tonight, and mm. so this is a great chance to get to know all of these new artists. MTV will be out there covering it. We're dropping all of our content on YouTube, on TikTok, all the socials, yeah. so that we can introduce our fans to these great acts, man. You're too young to remember, but today is the anniversary of MTV in 1981 when Come they used on. to play music videos. I don't even know what they're doing now, other than we're, what you're telling us about. Hey, we're doing this. Yeah. We're covering the festivals. We're on YouTube. Um, I'm, I'm dropping all of my interviews with all of these artists every time they release their albums. Uh, we have our TikTok page. You can follow yeah. me at Domati to see all the content we're doing. And I've been going all summer to almost every single festival I can get to to grab these artists, to feel the energy. We've got viral interviews with Sexy Red. That's that's out right now. You can check it out. It's not good for broadcast, so check it out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 What was that again? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but Sexy Red is performing this year, too. <laughs> too. But, uh, yeah, that's where all yeah. of our, because everything is digital now. That's where yeah. all of our content lives. Do you need a retro reporter to talk about the 80s? You doggone right I do. Let's do it. <laughs> and this would be the perfect day to sign you up, man. Yeah. Oh, Can God. I get a sponsorship with Blue Sky Inn? <laughs> 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 I don't know. It's a cool shirt. It's a cool shirt. Can I ask, do you get, yes. I mean, you know, if we're out of the demo for Lollapalooza, do you get exhausted at any of these festivals or some that you're like, ah, I don't want to go to another one? Do you ever find that or there's some that you don't want to go to? I'm glad you If you're over 25, you go to the festival. The main thing, do not wear your best shoes, okay? <laughs> there are rules. Yes. Don't get upset when the kids are stepping on shoes. That is the culture of the festival. So I don't, though, because there are ways to experience these festivals. Like Blink-182 is performing, like I said, the Killers, Hozier. These yeah. are acts that appeal to a certain generation. So there are VIP tickets you can grab. There are areas, tents where you can be comfortable. There are air conditions. So even if you are out of that demo, you can go relax and so enjoy So let's yourself. assume I'm out of that demo. Would I, <laughs> Hypothetically. Would I be welcomed there among the people, or would I be you would be welcome side eye? <laughs> you would be welcome in my heart. OK. <laughs> you know, I, I, is there any act that you, I see, like I know when my daughters went, they would wait like four hours to be in the front or, or like all day. Yes, so yes, you'd yes, be yes. at the front of the stage. Is there any act for you, having covered all these people, that you would be willing to wait in the front if you didn't have VIP access? That is a Who great is that question. For you? Ooh, ooh, ooh. I might have to I might actually have to go with Kendrick. Ah. So Kendrick played Lollapalooza last year, also Red Hot Chili Peppers. Yeah. Kendrick's performance was electric, one of the hardest performances I've ever seen. Future and Metro Boomin. Mm -hmm. whose record with Kendrick kicked off this whole feud with Drake. Uh, they're <laughs> performing this weekend as well. I would also love to see them up close and personal. There's certain artists whose energy is electric. Yeah, Good. yeah it'd probably be Kenny. Well, and, uh, if you have any questions about Flock of Seagulls, just give me a call. <laughs> you know I got you. He's super cool. Yeah. <laughs> I was. You need to come out there. He, no, he wasn't even back then. <laughs> he I was back then, okay? He's lying to you. That. I've seen some throwback <laughs> pictures. I don't believe it. Uh, Lollapalooza kicks off today. You can follow Delmar on social media for all the festival highlights. Thanks for being here. Good to see you. Always great to be here.